Hey, what's up guys? Oh man, welcome. Welcome to today's stream. I, I, I just oh, I woke up so early and now my eyes are itching like crazy. <laughs> oh, do you ever have those days? I have them way too often. I, I kind of hate them. Anyways, look at this. Stuff has changed. I, uh, I saw a new door post, which is interesting. I like that. Also, yeah, we didn't get the house. Oh, uh, boo. We didn't get it. Oh, well, what can you do, right? So for today, because I don't want to go off doing way too many things, uh, what I want to do is we're going to be following his footsteps, which is level 45 uh, class quest for the white mage. Uh, we also have some class quests to do for the, for the, uh, the ninja. Um, and, and also just trying leveling these guys up. Then as the warrior, we actually have 665 of these elegant tombstones of poetics. Which, which we can actually do uh, a new weapon or something that will help. And I'm thinking accessory. Uh, we actually have some decent gear by, because we got it. Uh, but I... Uh, oh no, actually with the accessories quite great as well. Decisions, huh? Decisions. I had to get up around 7, get to my car, to the workshop, and we'll face around another 1k bit. Oh, damn. I am so sorry to hear that. Yeah, those things are no fun, man. No fun whatsoever. So I'm not sure if I want to do anything on the tank first. Well, the others... See this, this, this number, like 29... Uh, the white mage 37 and then the warrior 115 i don't think i can justify uh, um, gearing up my warrior first you know it, it is what it is it is what it is we'll have to do that so we we'll, we'll definitely will be doing some of the roulette missions um we're not the leveling the guild test uh, and I, I will probably do the do the roulette for leveling i know the they don't really sink you all that great, but still. I kind of want to wait. You know, the leveling by itself is going to be extra long, the missions. Yeah, 115 carries me into Evansward easily. Yeah, I know. This is it, It's crazy, man. I'm so fortunate. So fortunate. So, we also have to unlock certain of uh, the new dungeons. And I should actually... Let's take a look. Uh, Final Fantasy XIV post our Realm Reborn Dungeons. Uh, I'm sure there is like a list of things that I can do. Let's take a look here. Uh, main scenario, main scenario. And then leveling, leveling, leveling. So the Trauma Queen... Uh, Ghost Emperor is not supported by the duty roulette. No. Uh, serious business. Did I? Not yet. Pharaoh Serious. Let's take a look. Oh, I don't see it in there. At least there's a bunch that have some requirements. Hard dungeons. And some other one. Item level sync 110. There you go. Like Wondrous Palace. Endor's Keep, uh, Pharaoh, Sirius, Copper Bell, etc, uh, etc. Et They're all eye level 110. So I'm actually able to do them on my tank. I'm just not able to do them anything anywhere else. You know, we'll, we'll just get that. Uh, that's the painful one. <laughs> Great. I like painful ones. Anyways, let's go back to following in his footsteps, back to the Shroud. Cam Tranquil, which at least, which at least should actually give me some some gear for my uh, for my white mage over here. Uh, uh, hopefully we can do the um, the level fifty one shortly. Uh, but I do want to get the gear first, just so we have something else to look at. Uh, we have a lot of work to do at some point. At least I have a lot of work to do at some point because some of these inventories are getting quite full. Yeah, and that's going to be disastrous. Uh, I kind of don't like that. So let's talk to Ryan or Sen over here. 
Your command of the white magic has advanced considerably in a yes, the time draws near. Let us begin our preparation for the quieting. At all, um, all its roots, the ritual is no different than the act of pacifying that you have already performed. The difference lies only in the difficulty of the effort. The Great One possesses a power unfentably more immense than the elements you have communed with thus far. Power so immense that a mage can be easily overwhelmed by the sheer force of its will. To prevent such a cast catastrophic fate, our traditions decree the creed that a, sp a special garb must be done before performing the ritual. I'm thinking that we'll probably be looking like her. So, we, which is still cool. I quite like how she looks. I have prepared for you these pieces, but I fear they will not avail you in their current state. So, it is that I... Uh, so, it is that I would send you on a journey. I trust you know the story of a to account. Where among the uh, Pajal, he left the forest behind to travel the realm, healing the land and its people. As tribute to his wanderlust, after he passed, his ashes were divided among several yearns, which, uh, which were in turn carried to the uh, far reaches of the realm. And it was there. In the distant land that the great may uh, in the distant in the wow in the distant land that the great mage uh, so loved that his ashes were buried. The monuments erected in his honor in and monuments erected. Okay, blah 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 blah. You are to go on a pilgrim. Of course I am. I'm a white mage. What else? To go to the site and receive the blessings of your forebearer. Only then will the garb. I have gifted you be in pune with the divine powers. Mind you, you will find that these places are not as welcoming as they might have been in the master's time. The first site is on the shores of the west, uh, western uh, Latnosea, in a place now feared as the Serpent's Tongue, home to a band of foul pirates. The next is to be found in Mordona. In that overgrown labyrinth of roots and vines, so affectionately known as the Tangle. I do hope that Master, uh, I do hope that Master's ashes have survived those most oppressive environments. The third site I would have you visit is perhaps the most treacherous location of the lot. Roundbars push in the northern Talalan, a stone thrown from an imperial stronghold. I urge you to exercise extreme caution. Ain't that nice? Ain't that nice? Uh, let's go with them in style. Let's go to the airport. And now, now we actually have the, um, the the ability to fly with a chocobo, which is great. It's gonna be fun. Let's just not close up on Chocobo, but... Okay, where do we need to go? It is... Right over there. Serpent Stong. Man, we lost all of that. Okay, well, that's kind of, you know... Oh, well. You know what I love is that you can just actually just fly over all of these hills. They really took into consideration. They wanted mounts to be able to fly. You can actually walk on it. You are not able to walk on it. Never mind. It seemed like a flat surface, but but it, apparently it isn't. Oh well. Give him some more to eat. Actually, looking forward to uh, leveling the uh, the good old white mage. It's a good class. It's a fun class. Very versatile. Because you are going to be paying attention to not only your surroundings, but also to your party members. The Oh my god, did I just get 
really hit like that? Yes, I did. You should not have attacked me. Let's go. Yeah, okay, don't feel like it. Go away. What the hell is this? Did I miss it? Hmm. Interesting. I might be in the wrong location then. It seems so much. It gets quite lovely with the blood lilies. Yes, you know, it, it, it does look extremely well. Keep going. No, this is definitely not the right direction. Pray before the grave. You would actually assume that they would give you the location, huh? It's not over here, no. Okay, let's go take this sugar in down. And then we'll get on our chocobo and we'll just see what it is that we can find. He's trying. Okay, let's go. Apparently, I'm I'm blind as a bat. I, mu I must have missed it. Okay, it is down. What the hell is it? Wait, what? Oh, there it is. Where the hell were we then? Yeah, we were in the wrong location. Never mind. Okay, let's go click this. say right let's go to Madonna we'll get it done so when we are done uh, we might oh look at that there's a bunch of blue quests around here. An outlandish man with a very cool looking mask. Wait, no way. No. No, this cannot be. Is he? I'm not going to tell who I think it is. Uh, we'll get there. Do, uh, do I know you? Ah. Unless I am very much mistaken, you are the famed adventurer who bested the Galian Empire's general. Are you not? The great Unedos in herself. Amazing. And more than a little... Wow. Senedipidus? Senedipidus. One might even call it fate. I but recently received word of a truly unique opportunity. You see, the opportunity to uh, the like of which none but one of your proven worth could take uh, could take advantage. Or whatever. The reward, not less than the accumulated knowledge of a fallen civilization. The risk, a single blood stab could cost you your life. But what is a little danger to a storied hero such as you? A woman with absolute confidence in her own ability stands to prove, uh, stands to profit handsomely from this adventure. No, no, I crave no uh, recomp recompense. 
for my part in bringing this opportunity to your attention. The historic discoveries you shall make will be reward enough, I assure you. If my words have feigned the flames of your curiosity, then I bid you to seek a man by the name of Rembrus in Saint Coinan's Find. It is he who stands at the doorway to untold marvels, awaiting the arrival of a champion bold enough to march across the threshold. Fuck yeah. Um, he is over there. Ah. Has to be. It is. It is. Busted. Busted. It is him. Oh yeah, I love that. That's that's perfect. I really like that. Uh we got a Blunzun. Holy crap, one, two, three. Damn. You're Ose Dosen by the onion, the very woman I seek at wow, Dreistwise behest. How do I know the potbanger? Why? We train together in the Culinarian's Guild. He has a place in Costa del Sol now, the Flying Shark. Not the sharpest knife in the block is Dries the Daft. Think it's in the name, but he's loyal. He's got a friend out there by the name of Wisecat. I think we know that one. I think we do. I think we do know him. And he seems to be in need of your help. What say you go look for him? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do it. Why not? Next up. King of the Hill. That seems like a very hard dungeon. Your Ozai, your Unai, by the... Oh well, my god, by the onion again. I was hoping that I'd come by. I've got a message from an old friend of mine. Need your help for an important task, he says. It's highly confidential business, so I can't give you his name. Let's just say he's well known in Limsa. Odds are you recognize him. Any road. I'm not at liberty to divulge anymore. If you're, you've a mind uh, to take on this task, head over to Limsa and seek out a bloke named Dens uh, Denson. That's not my friend, mind you, but he's one of his men. Oh, do I have a lot of these missions, man? It's definitely pirates. That is definitely another dungeon. By the onion! You're ruining me! You could have come you couldn't have come at a better time. A friend of mine sends word that he needs a capable adventurer. You see. Uh, and I naturally thought of you. How uh, how Who's this friend you ask? Why? None other than Commodore Commodore Arena of the Yellow Jacket. He and I met back when I first started out as a culinarian, and we've been friends ever since. Any road, I'd appreciate it if you pay him a visit and inquire as to what he needs doing. You'll find him at Coral Tower with the Yellow Jackets. Well, I'll be damned. There's really a lot of these. Three more. I've seen more and more visitors in this godforsaken place lately. Most of them battle harder types like uh, battle harder types seem seeking a worthy test of their metal. I trust that I can count on you then. Look, you didn't hear this from me, but. Word has it that copper bell mines are looking not unlike the 8th hell in recent days. Stone Torch would have us believe that they have matters under control, but a minor acquaintance of mine would beg to differ. He says the torches have proven far more adept at quelling rumors than. My lord, here we go again. Heck. Hackathon Chirus? Hackathon Chirus? Whatever, if you catch my drift. No, I don't, because I don't know the word. Why do I betray his uh, Why do I betray his knowledge to you? I fear that my uh, fear for my friend's life and mine own as well. 
Should these hulking monstrosities break free to the surface? It's a challenge you seek then. Uh, what say you accidentally finding your way to Copper Bell Mine and, and proper your and, and proffer your service? It's not like I have another chance, I think. There you go. Wrath of Queer. Oh, these are all the hard dungeons, I think. Ah! An adventurer who can hold her own in battle. It's just so happened I've gotten word of a new challenge for one of your talents. Requires a bit of traveling and a dash of heroics. But I, uh, but it would be worthy a while. Eastern Talon loves this time of the year. You've heard of the training ground at Talatili, Tal I wager. The place fell into this disuse after the calamity but some adventurer or another put it to right its owners aim to train gladiators and adventurers once more just as the old days a little a little paint a little mass burial and now the place is ready to take on challenge wait mass burial the fuck if you're key if you're at all keen on the notion go talk to my friend he's here great ah there is a industrious end an adventurer in need of a bit of business if i'm not mistaken the end hill you want is Amaja and Sons mineral concern. Something kicked it over good. They've put out words of adventurers. Wait, they, they've put out word for adventurers. Have skill, will move fast, that sort of thing. Perfect for you, I warrant. The client. Uh, a bit of a handful. A might aggressive, but nothing you can't handle. The twins. You'll find them at the Miners Guild. Talk to the person over there. He is the Milder of the true. Okay. Okay, we got a buttload of things to do. At least the ultimate ballot. Your reputation precedes you, nay. In fact. It's for this reason that I like you to introduce uh, that I like to introduce you to someone. That minstrel at the end of the bar uh, w uh, wandered in here the other day. He said he was seeking inspiration for a new ballad, the sort only an adventurer of distinction could provide. Who better than the woman who saved the world to give his mi uh, to give this minstrel the stories he seeks, huh? You the gentleman, I say. You gotta be kidding me, man. You better pay up. You better pay up. Oh, I'm not singing this. Dawn may banish even the darkest night. Yet ever shall primal desire burn. The two swords, Zalvai and lay them low. A blade born of light and a blade forged of might. Alas. Men may entrust this fate unto but one. Lest you wonder, these are the words of Archon Louis Soi. While not written as poetry, I find poetry within them none nonetheless. Yeah, actually, it's right. Years ago, when I arrived in this land, I was beset with peril day and night. Forced to endure countless trials which tested my mind, my body, and my faith. And I am not ashamed to admit that I would have faltered. Had it not been for the help of a handful of nameless adventurers. Honest men and women who pro uh, proffered uh, who, who the hand of friendship to a very soul and let him save from the darkness. When I look upon you... I am reminded of them. I can tell that you are well traveled and possess uh, and possess both constance and uh, constancy and character. You are a woman of adventuring profession, yes. I seek a valiant hero 
whose, de uh, who de whose deeds might serve as inspiration, and I have reason to believe I found her. After all, was it not you who felled Gaius from Belsar and his uh, Allegian weapon? You must tell me everything. Everything what happened. Omit nary a single detail, I beg of you. Oh my god. Don't tell me I get a selection going or something. Truly a tale worthy of legend. And so eerie to match the writings of Archon Louis Wa. Two shall a sword shall lay. Two, two shall. Oh wow, two swords shall vie and lay them low. A blade born light. Okay, that's we already read that. The black wolf was a conqueror who inspired to rule through might, and the weapon was key in his ambition. Yet in the end, the people of Eosia entrusted their fates to a brilliant blade, the warrior of light. A rather fitting moniker, in my humble opinion. Thank you, at last I found the inspiration I sought. A battle to decide the fate of the realm. The words, the notes, I feel them coming together. Your tale, Une, your song. Please don't sing. Jesus Christ. From an arrow long forgotten, a blade of midnight dawned. From a distant land uncharted, a warrior who bears the dawn. Ultima's Bane? Ballad? Wait, what? Wait, do, do we get a song or a dungeon? Oh, I'm actually getting gloves here. Interesting. Is, is that... That's a... It's a trial. I've done this one before. High end trial. Yeah. Uh, we'll check that out later. Uh, next up. Wait, you're sneaking over there? Are you the friend? I think that's the friend we're trying to find here. Uh, blood of stone. Of blood for stone. I seek a certain adventurer for a cause most just. Are you not Une? Ah. I thought you had the right aspect. Twas you who played the thief in the night at the stone vigil. The dragon's guard attack you jealously. I had said... Uh, it's sad. Uh, you s Yet you slipped unseen into the cloudy fortress. Oh, well, kind of butchered everything in our past, but fi fine. Whatever you say. It will not be their keep for much longer, however. The forces of Vishgard amass at the Sea of Clouds. Now this is for your ears only. But the blockade is but a prelude to an attack. Lord Element commands the siege and he would have you... What the fuck was that? I, I, I couldn't see that. Would have your counsel. I am but one of many who seek you at his behest. You must be a woman of rare quality. Proud knights of Durandere are not accustomed to talking, let alone seeking outside of help. Ishgard is the cradle air I... Ishgard is the cradle air I breathe. And I yearn to see the stone vigil reclaim from the Dravonian Horde. Dravanian Horde. You will... Uh, will you not go to Whitebrim Front and aid Lord Derelmond? I would... You just, why didn't he just send me a message? Not just a messenger. Okay, what, what do you want? Ah, forgive me, friend. A most chilling encounter has my nerves on edge. I was traveling through the shroud when a man coasted me out of nowhere. His eyes dartling wildly in fear, he spoke of a haunted mansion from which the tortured screams of young maiden can be heard day and night. Hawket Manor, was it? Yeah. So that's also the hard dungeon for that. Extreme version of the Ultima. Ah, I actually did that without realizing it was an extreme dungeon. I would, I did it on my Black Mage. Ah, look at Mana. That was it. You purged the self-same... 
men's of its unholy inhabited some time ago. That is curious indeed. The man recounted the events as if they had happened not days ago. While it would put my heart at ease to know his tale was not a fancy born. It was not but a fancy born of few too many flagons of meat. The poor soul had not the air of a drunk or a liar. Perhaps you know someone who could set light on this matter. What do you want? Keepsake. Uh, I need to do... Uh, okay, so we'll actually get a mission after Amador Keep. Interesting. What else? Uh, that's the leaves. We'll do at some point. Not right now. We don't have to. What we do have to do is press J and figure out this one. Let's put that at the top. There you go. So we need to go all the way over there. Following in his footsteps. Uh, I'm not, not sure what I'm doing. Let's go. Oh, that is some cool gear on that chocobo. I like that. Oh, wrong door. Actually, let's not constantly fly. I love flying. But we don't have to constantly fly. I fly over this because of the frogs. Kind of don't like the frogs. With their attack. Look at that going and all of these lights. There you go. Let's deal with this more bow. I'm not going to use a stunner on my chocobo like 15 times. Really don't want to. So uh, tell me, Ida, how far are you in um, in the story so far? Okay, with that done, we get boots. Uh, today's title on Stormblood didn't advance all this time. But the sides would just take a month. Yeah. Yeah, that will probably be right. Uh, but we'll be doing, if you want, uh, I was thinking about doing a tiny bit of a miniature event. Uh, maybe this weekend, kind of depends on how my um, time schedule has been will be treating me. Good stab, the ultimate, wait, what? Ultimate ballot is over there. Uh, and maybe just kick out some of these hard dungeons. Like, for you, they're not hard. For me, they're probably insane. So we'll just do a bit of a party stream and just do, you know, whatever. Do I just need to enter in here? Confront the ultimate web, ultimate pain. Okay, yeah, we don't need to do it like this then. We could most likely just let it be for what it is. True. I've run several on them, not too often. So what I want to do right now is just once these uh, dungeons are out of the way, we'll just continue the story. Maybe we should leave the, um, you know, the, the leveling stuff for another time, like the, doing the dungeons and the, uh, the tokens. Okay, and we're getting there. And right, now what? So we can't do anything over here any further. That's good. At least it will give us some uh, some points and stuff, you know. Uh, I want to get into the next expansion relatively soonish. It means that most of the dungeons that I come across, like I was very hesitant 
when I was playing like on daily fix, just waiting for people to run in with me. Nowadays, I'm just going with the flow. Your save returns hardens me, you know. I can feel new found powers emanating from the garb I gave you. I trust at this stage. I tr I trust at this stage of your pilgrimage uh, was a success. Now that you have traveled the realm and seen the land the master did, I would share you with you the rest of his tale. The history claims that Otama Khan disappeared in the mountains, um, the kobold in the kobold motherland. This is not untrue, but there is more to the story. When the great mage did not return from his journey, one of his most devoted students went in search for him. As the legends have it, the young mage single-handedly fought off veritable legions of kobold while scoring the mount of any sign of his master. Sadly, it was as all it feared. Though the young mage eventually found his master, the great Otoa can't live no more. As if the death of a man of the man would not were not enough, Tyrus uh, Okan's Otoa uh, Khan's great staff, a mighty relic passed down by his ancestors, was lost to the shadows. Un Deterred, the young mage fought off the cobalt horde to carry his master's remain back to the surface. A ceremony was held in honor of the master's life and deeds. The urns housing his ashes were carried off to the far reaches frontiers, of which he was so fond of in his living years. All the, ur all the urns that is except for this one, yes. Though the precise location is known to only a few, uh, the master Atoa also rests close to, uh, at to home. Here in Twelvesuit, not far from Proud Creek, you will find yet another monument to the great mage. Take with you this habit and, pray, and pay your respects as before. If you keep your intentions in your heart and in your mind, then the healer's rope shall be your reward. Um, Isha, <laughs> sorry, man, I, I knew the boat. Oh, that came in from deep. I've only run a few dungeons with trust and duty support. Um, trust and duty support. I, I don't know trust and duty support. What, what is trust and duty support? Oh, there's some monsters here we need to kill, which we probably won't. Wait, where is that? Oh, oh, bite me then. Trust is... When you run regular dungeons with NPC parties. Shoot him. Is it that you just so you go just do the dungeon and say I want to go in with an NPC party? Is that it? Oh, you are brave. Well, I, it's a great way of getting familiar with like the dungeon I I've hit, and there is a dungeon in the list I've done once. And it had this relatively annoying thing going on. Where... You... Where the hell is that? Jesus. Uh, where you have these doors at the end. Check your main menu. Okay, we'll do. Give me a second here. I'm just, just some headless knight decided that it is time for me to... Joined them.
use this. Check main menu. It's on the duty down towards the bottom. Trust, no, it's not open. I don't have trust open. See, trust is done. No trust for me. Has it something to do with the garrison then? I don't know uh, about the the trust system like 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 at all like I honestly don't have it maybe no don't have it wait where is where's the stuff I thought she gave me the guard yeah true but, but, you know, I, I, I just don't have it. The urn holding master's ashes were stolen. This can't be. Oh! Grave robbery is a damned enough crime in itself. But what manner of scoundrel would dare to find the resting place of a pajal? Rest assured that I will investigate this heinous crime immediately. In the meanwhile, your pilgrimage demands you travel to one last destination. The final leg of your journey will take you to the very place that master, where the master draw his last breath. Ogromoro, the homeland of the kobolds in the outer Lanosia. It's in there, in plain sight of the kobold dig. That the student of whom I spoke did erect a monument to his fallen master. And send me to my death then. Great. That's how you do it. Well, we need you to do something with a big ass tree. Yet we do want to send you to the place master died. Makes so much sense. Okay, anything in here that we need to do? Uh, no. You got to be kidding me, he died over here. I've been here several times. Maybe I need to do this to at least one dungeon to unlock the trust system. Could, could that be the case? Because I've not done a dungeon without, you know, a, a group. Now, I don't really agree with you on that one. Like, there's definitely dungeons I would run with NPCs. Just to get familiar with the dungeon itself. Especially the harder dungeons. I would definitely try to get familiar. I don't read guides. That's on me, I know. Maybe I should start reading guides. That would save me time, huh? Welcome back, Une. The journey was not an easy one, I trust, and yet I knew that the master would guide you safely back to me. In your travels, you have received the blessing of the great ancestor. And yet, this was not the sole reason. I sent you on, your, on this pilgrimage because you sensed something in my intentions during your trip. 
Yes, you know. As she, as she who would inherit the master's legacy, I wanted you to truly walk in his footsteps. To see the realm in both its beauty and its suffering with your own eyes, as the great mage did so long ago. And yet, it is strange, no? A pirate's lair, a rampant jungle, a mountain of fire, and of all the hostile environments of which you journeyed, the single grave that spoiled was which rested right here at Forest Town. It's your brother. Yep. No, I think so. I think it's his brother. Um, I suspect this was the handiwork of no will, uh, witless grave robber, but rather someone who knew all too well the value of that which was buried within. We must uncover the truth behind the crime and return the master's ashes to the rightful resting place. And quickly. Are you with me? Yes? Fine. I'll do it. Uh, I just locked it up and it opens later in the MSQ. It, it, it's probably done a post a post uh, a realm reborn thing honestly guides are more of extreme difficult content later dungeons and stuff is designed straightforward enough kind of no it's true although we did have a dungeon at some point we had to run like several times because it was actually quite annoying it's fine so we are going to be getting a spell called Holy. And Holy gives an additional effect. is stun. Unfortunately, you cannot stun enemies more than three times. Still, it is a... An area of effect. Trust start at level 71. Then I've never seen the trust system. I'm sorry. Let's go. Grave robbery is a load summon of crime on its own. I want to defile the rest of a pile of jars. Such an act could only be performed by the lowest of bandit scum. Though I would like to think that the elements have already delivered due just to the villain. We must take no chances in allowing an escape. While you were away I put my best moogle on the hunt. Searching for the signs of the culprit of the stolen remains. I dare say... He should have a clue or two for us by now. At least. He better. If he values his little ball on his head. Holy sh... Man, you go dark really fast. Suffer it to say. Though many uh, forestborn think of the Mughals as blessed. My own personal experience has found them to be more touched than anything else. Strange then, right? Are the NPCs that you get, like, are they different? Like, are they stronger, smarter, faster? I don't know, more well behaved. Oh, mistress. You should have said such hurtful things. It's most unbecoming of a seat, Sir Cooper, but fine. Don't listen to me. Why? I told her just the other day that this is why she remains, shall we say, unspoken for. She might not react to that phrase at present, but her era was indeed fierce. Of course, you have not come to discuss my mistress temper, but the grave robbery, a most unforgivable act of villainy. If I do say so myself, which I believe I just did, Cooper. I am pleased to say, and you will be pleased to hear, that the culprit did not escape Mughal's eyes, Kippo. Well, my eyes, he did escape. My associate, um, Poki no Poki, however, claims to have seen a band of ruffians sulking off in the direction of a red belly hive with various and sundry stolen goods in tow. Amongst them, a rather conspicuous elaborate urn. I do not know what the red bellies are up to, but surely it can be nothing good. 
Please, you know, go quickly. If the urn is lost, I fear uh, Raya's O sire and will be the last of my worries. Holy crap, man. She is a devil in disguise. No, that, does, that explains the damn horns. She is not a gentle soul at all. She's a butcher. Cupo butcher. Give some more of those greens. I'm looking forward to like new new content. I kind of started skipping through Heavensward on Daily Fix at some point when I realized that I was going to do an an alt character. So looking forward to that. Okay, what do you want, uh, Pokey? Those thieving crooks. Those crooking thieves. Defiling the resting place of a Palja. Why? No amount of threshing, lashing, and bashing would suffice. Uh, Kupo, 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 Po. Why? If it isn't the lovely white mage Kupo, Kupa, uh, Koop Sharp Kupa spoke of. Not a moment too soon. Why? I was just about to swoop in and give them their... Come up penance? Myself? Now that you're here, uh, uh, however, I believe I'll just sit back and enjoy the show, Keeper. Those vile red bellies. Toss the urn into the... Wow, into some... Wreck... Shangle weapon? Uh, wagon? A uh, most... Ich noble fate for a pal, uh, Padjali legend. I do declare and carted it northwise towards their hive. You will retrieve it safe and sound, won't you, Kupo? It's a pigeon. I am hearing the pigeon all day. But yeah, unfortunately, we did not get our medium house indeed. I, uh,. I do feel bad about that. I was looking very much forward to it. Uh, we should probably do it like this. But oh well. Hopefully, in a few days, we'll uh, find a new medium house. Uh, what we need to do is we need to just go and scout out... Um, We need to scout out medium houses. Yeah, I don't like this. This I've been doing this for so long this way that it, it, I'm just misclicking constantly. You know, it's a matter of changing my ways. Well, I've done this uh, this day in the game. We'll get there. Hey, here we go. The ashes. I thought we had to return it. Thank you, Une. The remains of our exalted before bear are uh, hauled away. By brigands like a sack of loot. Is that what our land has come to? There can be no doubt. It's in the Great One's fury that brings such chaos in the Twelveswood. The situation is grave indeed. I shall have our wood whalers deal with the red bellies. We have more important matters before us. And yet, I fear we have hit another slag. 
Though the urn has been safely recovered, the harsh treatment it suffered in the hands of the bandit has taken its toll. Uprooted from its proper resting place, the power of a Toa Kant once housed within has grown dim. I shall return the urn to its rightful home. Perhaps over time it will return its former state. And yet I fear time is a luxury we do not have. We must explore other means to enchant the ritual garbs. I will consult with my brother and see what knowledge he might have to offer. In the meantime, I would ask you your ma I would ask that your you master your newfound skills as best as you can. There's no telling when the Great One's fury might grow too strong to contain. We must ever be prepared. So we get holy. Okay. So we I don't think we can actually continue with level for the level 51 then. No. Uh where's the skill? Here. Holy. Which is you know, it is actually quite I like quite like it. You can cast it constantly, and it, it does have a very healthy barrier. Especially if you do it like with F10. It really goes quite fast. But then again, you know, it's... Um, the stun though effect is only like 3 seconds, but it could save your life. Uh, now that it is out of the way... Let's equip that. Get that weird thing. Do you have that as well? You do not. Okay, right, fine. Whatever. So I think we do want to make sure that we level the white mage at some point. Um, especially we're doing the daily. And I do need to do the daily. So let's just do that real quick. I will actually get maybe two levels out of it. Level 47. Um, let's go join. Should not take forever. Let's go. Come on, DPS. You can do it. You are fine. Just do it. I'm going to be assuming we're either going to be doing like Aaron Vale or some some somewhat higher level dungeon or it's going to be the very first one. That's how it has been going all the time. Wait, no oh way. Oh, this is This this isn't a hard dungeon, right? No, this could not be. Level 23, never mind. This is should be going really fast. Say hi. Can't use half of my skills. We'll definitely have to pay attention for that. Got this miniature tank. Always nice. I don't want to attack too much because this could be rather, rather annoying. Also... He is a paladin, and I can't do regen right now, which is a bloody... It's a bit of a drag. Uh, we do have to go uh, start and heal. Okay, we do, do one more, then a heal. Uh, this one. That's what you get, man. It's, it's always... When you're starting losing skills, it's quite, you know, annoying. But oh well. It is what it is. Stop complaining, you know. Enjoy, enjoy it. Do a bit of a cure. Like I said, don't want him to die. Would be awkward. Alright, let's go. 
I think it's just focusing on this one it was. I also don't think we'll level up twice from this. You know, maybe from the additional XP, but... I don't know. I don't think so. And it should start to be brighter and brighter in here. And then we're starting to see um, these little minions. I kind of want to make sure that we focus on the boss. We should actually be able to kill it before they do any any major harm. Like, there's no point in trying to get them. Everyone will be harmed. There you go, come on. And he's gone. There you go, easy. Yeah, I'll, I'll just greet it, but we can't really use anything of it. Oh boy, what are you doing, mate? What are you doing? Oh, barely in time there. Even he realized he uh, he start he's he just used his skill. And also, what's this class? I don't know, but it definitely had a bit of a pain, painful thing going on. I'll just, like I said, I'll greet it because I don't really need it. Okay, let's start doing the heal. And we'll just keep going with arrow. That was too close, man. That was too close. Okay, so let's start healing him. Let's not wait as long as last time. <laughs> he did not get confident by that. I can definitely say that he didn't. I would not feel confident if my healer took so long. Yeah, he's smart. I like that. He really is smart. It, it, it takes more time. But now I need to be careful. A bit of heal. I'm unable to use arrow. Okay, there we go. He's doing it again. Skull.
Yeah, it's a bit of shame. I don't think we'll definitely. Really, we got actually we got some arrow upgrade, which is nice. Great, great. I do need FC tokens. Like I do need uh, not FC tokens. I do need seals. We have enough FC points actually. We're we're up to f we actually have 50 members right now, which I always like. Things are going well. I kind of want. I'm missing my crafters, to be absolutely honest. Um, because I feel like I'm neglecting uh, my duties to craft with Zell, who has been mainly doing the crafting. Well, we'll get there. We'll get, we'll, we'll, I kind of want to wait until after we unlock the like a, a good, as very good region. to do it like the diadem it's invulnerable go. I might need to do a medica. Man, it's easy. GG. Play commendation. Definitely the tank. He was doing a great job. Uh, great, great. Yeah, we, we, we actually got that done. Did we level uh, only to level 47? So that's basically the end of the journey so far on this. Let us sort that out. Let's go to our ninja. Pirates versus... Oh, well. Yeah, at least... They don't talk like bloody pirates. They're in Limsa. It's been a while since I actually played on the Assassin. Could also do the guild test. You need to do the guild test like, I don't know, like 200 times or something. For uh, one of the achievements. I kind of do want to do all of the achievements. Like, why not, right? Why not? Hmm? Oh, I am in the right direction. I was like... Of course, we need to go indoors. So this would probably teach us the the last uh, ninjutsu, right? And that will open up a lot of possibilities. So that's going to be fun. So he, uh, here's Oboro. Oboro. No, actually, it teaches us the ability... Um, Shukuhi? Whatever. Move quickly to the specific location. Cannot be executed while bound. So it's it's a way to get out of the like ranged attacks fast. I'm I'm going to assume. You have trained well since we last met, Una. I heard not a cry from the door as you entered, nor a creak from the floorboards as you drew near. This much is clear. Neither waterfall nor uh, nor men of wood will serve to hone your sense further. No. A shinobi of your abilities received his tutelage from the field. Consider this your first lesson in the art of assassination. I need not remind you who our target is. He is ever the elusive bird. And yet, I have come across more. Some information that I believe may avail us. 
Rumor has it that the captain of the bloody executioner has narrowly evaded several attempts on his life in recent days. This is doubtless the work of Karasu and his men. None other are so bold or skilled as to even consider such an attack. Nothing short of death uh, will cause a shinobi to forsake his mission. Karasu will strike again. The only questions are where and when. Answers. Answer those questions and it will be us. Paying him a surprise visit next time. Fortunately, I know of a man who might be able to give us what we seek. The captain has a trusted lieutenant by the name of Wolstan, a man who, if rumors are to be believed, is known to fancy a hot spring bath. I recall reading of a famous bath resort not far from here, but the name escapes me. Have you any idea where it might be? Oh my god. It is... I think it's Camp Bronze Lake. Why, yes, that does sound familiar in Upper La Nocia. Off to the east, was it? Let us make our way there at once. Oh, we're not walking, dude. We'll, we'll just teleport. Yeah, it's definitely... Wait, well, we've been there several times. Like, one map next. How could you not know? How could you not know this? Oh, I like that garment. Really. That looks absolutely fantastic. Anyways, let's go. I had no idea that so many Oceans also enjoyed public bathing. I would say that it is a comforting sight. But in truth, it makes me all the more nostalgic for the pleasures of my homeland. That said, seeing all these people, seeing all these people smiling about giving me a smile... Uh, Wait, giving all the peoples milling about gives me cause for concern. Even with these disguises, it's only a matter of time before our foreign mannerism raises eyebrows about uh, amongst the more observant types. Yes. Best we stay out of sight until our men arrive. Let us keep watch from high above until it's time to act. It is time. Uh, the time has come for me to impart to you another technique, which we call uh, shukushi, shukushi, shukushi. You may think of it as compressing the, f the physical space around you, allowing you to cross great distance in the blink of an eye. Go ahead, Une, give it a try. But that's it. Oh yeah, we'll do it. Hmm. Yeah, let's give it a try. Oh, it goes like that. Oh, f oh yeah, it's nice. Cooldown of a minute? Oh man. So, Abora is ready to proceed with the operation. I trust that Shu Shukushi is now second nature to you. Of course not, dude. What are you talking about? Very well. I shall await you on the rooftop. But be warned. While the technique will allow you to cover great distance in the blink of an eye, it does not allow you to soar at will through the sky. The ledge of which uh, Tsubaim now stands is at a level with a roof and should prove a suitable starting point. That said, a shinobi is ever resourceful. If you would make your way to the rooftops by other means, 
that will serve just as well. Uh, where, where, where that guy? Where's that guy? Wait, you gotta be kidding me! Like we need to go over there. There is the desk. Oh my god. Wait, what the f what the f What the fuck? It's a kind of a oh she button to use. Yeah, it's a, it's definitely an oh shit moment. Fine, I'll just stand over here. Don't need no bloody shinobi tricks for this. Yeah, it, it, it's an interesting skill, I, I think. Yeah, sure. Nothing like a steaming bath, a bottle of fine wine, and a couple of boxum wrenches to ease what ails ya. Eh? As far as I'm concerned, the captain can take its bloody time. Wolfstam! Look at that, man. We're just out of cover right away. Just immediately. That's how you do it as an assassin. Very now, very well. Now we only. Employ the bamboo raving pipes. Oh no! Um, I do not question that such methods have, have served as well in Doma. But might bamboo not arouse suspicious a suspicion in these environments? Do you truly believe so? But underwater surveillance was always my area of expertise. I have an idea that I believe is well suited both to our target and the customs of this land. It will, uh, I, it will require just a simple change of garb and a bottle or two of fine. Seriously? She's taking the time to go and take a bath. We will require your assistance, Une, as it seems it's... A, as I see it, there is no way the man would refuse a drink from a alluring maiden like you. Oh, I'm not going to do weird stuff. Intriguing. And what pay well of pay tell will be my role in all of this. Uh, I was thinking that uh, your talents might best be put to use overseeing this operation. Yes, uh, from up there. I assure that nothing goes amiss, of course. To ensure nothing goes amiss, of course. He's going to be sulking. I must prepare now, Une. Meet me down below, out of sight, and I shall furnish you. With an item that will serve to deliver the final blow, as it were. Seriously, a bikini? Yeah, final blow? My sanity? What the hell is he? Oh no. Okay. <sighs> yeah, I'm really feel like hitting the shit oh shit button right now. 
Um, yeah. No. No, don't do that. Am I wearing it properly, Une? Now the costume to the garb is so revealing. Yeah. Regardless, I will entrust this to you. Though it may appear to be a simple bottle of wine, I have made a few enhancements to the recipe. Of do you know? A salty sea dog like Wolfstan is certain to be on his guard. I'll start him off with an untamed vintage. One season sufficient good spirits. That's your cue to step in with the strong stuff. Please don't make me wear this. I suspect that once his mind is uh, sufficiently addled. We will uh, gladly at uh, he will gladly take a swing for a minus a uh, minimum of fuss swig. Okay, now right, let's just begin. Please don't let like me do it. Okay, thank God. Yeah, I'm not even picturing that shit. I don't need that. Fine wine and fine wenches. Now this is what I had in mind when I look up the or when I took up the pirate life. There you go. You go 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 get yourself killed, mate. It's fine. What's this? Come to battle your friend here or for Wolfie's affection? Oh dear lord. Don't mind if I do. Har har. Someone fetch me a cup. Uh, that is the good stuff. It's a bit stronger than I re recall it. Maybe I should take a rash. Oh, you mustn't be so modest. Why, I had a wolf stand seven stomach. Uh, stom stomach? Once drank a whale under the table. <laughs> okay. Man, you should love to drink them, man. Eh? Oh, yeah, you better. Skives and... Skives a hey, good lash. Me bleeding duties have kept me from the bottle for too long. I'm out of practice. It's all your duties. Why that's so important and exciting. I'd do anything to hear more. This is so disturbing. Did you say anything? Well, maybe you've heard of the bloody executioner, the nastiest, bloodiest band of pirates. Whatever sailed on the bleeding seas. I reckon a captain sunk more guardian vessels than ever every other pirate combined. And just who do you think just and just who do you reckon keeps the captain safe from all the enemies he's made? Why that would be none other than his dear mate Wolfstan. The navigator have mercy. Should you not reme uh, return immediately to your captain, surely he is not safe without his most loyal, capable man at his side. Normal under normal normal circumstances, I'd be right. You'd be right, lass. But there's one flash even I can't follow him. Illport, aye. The man's a bloody particular about Grog. Says he can't concentrate unless he is on his own. Not that I'm complaining. It's the only time we get a dash in rest. But don't worry a little hard, non Le uh, non less eaten. Nobody known the captain's whereabouts uh, but me and I sure as hell, as, as bloody hell, ain't talking... Lassie, are you listening? Ah, uh, Lassie, gone. Yeah. Captain died. Just now. 
curious. He was just here a moment. Oh, these others are also just drunk. Okay. Yeah, that was an awkward mission. Could I? Oh, I have that. It's an elephant. Just keep your clothes on, miss. Uh, well, were you able to loosen our man's lips? Yeah, onward to Illport. I see. Captain is en route to Illport and alone at that. If I know Karasu, this knowledge has not escaped him. Doubtless he and his shadows already lie in wait. We haven't much time. Let's hurry to Illport and ambush the ambushes. Speaking of which, I need to check something, like, how far are we with no project on the way? Yeah, that's a problem we need to fix. Also, seems there's another blue quest here. Let's talk to him. Oh, serious business. Okay, cool. My first genuine assignment under Master Mimodoa. And now this. Whatever did I do to deserve such a faith? Oh, but where are my manners? I and Diamanda. A smith recent, recently in the employment of Naldic and Vimerals. I arrived in this part not a few days past to assist in the restoration of Parasirius. Little did I expect my arrival to be greeted in such a godforsaken song. A song I fought confident. I fought confident of my worst nightmares. Yes, I speak of a grim serenade of the soul sea witch that lured my poor father into a watery demise so many years ago. So I stand here with idle hands. Powerless to avenge his death. Powerless. To repay my debts to the master. After my father's mentor. Once my father's mentor. As now. As he now is mine. The agony of it all. If only my brother were here. He would see to it that. But alas my brother remains lost at sea. You're an adventurer, are you not? Perhaps if you were to defeat that siren. Yes, you must. If not for me, then for all of the sailors who seek safe passage across threatening seas. Seeking out Master at the pier, you'll find him glazing grimly at the direction of Pharasirius, lemoning our faith. Well... We'll do that in a second. Here's the destination for us. Ambushing the ambushes. Being actually up leveled. The sun sets and the board is cloaked in shadow. If there were a perfect time to strike. Him? Wait. Speak of the devil. Look at how those men walk. Those are no ordinary deckhands. Those are Imperial Shinobi. Waiting to bounce upon and slit the throat of any who would stand between them and their prey. Karasu is too proud to entrust such a vital mission to his lackeys. He is here somewhere, of this I am certain. Une 
You move forward and search the docks. I will approach from the opposite direction. Uh, Tsubame, you secure the escape route. I will not elude. I, he will not elude us this time. Take care to stay well hidden. Hidden from the eye of Karasu's shadows. And yet, I fear your task will be more complicated still. That's fine. That's bloody bad. For if it's not just the man that serves uh, Karatsu, but creatures of the night, creatures that see not with their eyes, but with their every fiber of their being, give them a wide breath, or all shall be for enough. That should be all. Time is short. We must move swiftly. Let's do it. That's fine, I effed up them bats. Oh, my dog is annoying. I need to go the other way around. Never mind. I need to flip this. And we leveled up from that. <laughs> oh, we leveled up because I'm an idiot. Ain't that nice. Fine, just do it without being stealthy. There's another bloody bat over there. Oh, he's over there. He already knows. He already knows. Because I'm not in hide anymore. What's, what's this? No, no, no. This isn't how the story goes. I'm supposed to be the one that surprises you. A million assassins around, see? Oh, never mind. The tables have turned today, Karasu. Now face your death like the man you once were. I must say, popularity really goes, uh, really does have its downsides. Fine. If you're so eager to dig your own graves, here's your bloody shovel. Okay. Fine. Let, let the master deal with it. Defeat the lackeys. We'll get there. Not a lackey. Was I sitting on his head? Huh. Okay. Where the hell did this guy come from?
Maybe we can use that uh, that weird skill that we just got. Yeah, that's very anticlimactic. Are you slow? He escaped. He escaped. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Master, you had one job. You failed at it. Yep. Yep, he did. Such a waste. I slippery bastard. Yep. And you let him go, man. We have come too close to abandon hope. Come, Tsumabe. Une, let us return to the safety of the storehouse and take stock of our options. She looks cool, by the way. Way better than that dumb bikini. You mean the failure of this sword does not become you, Karasu? Who the hell is it? Way, no way. Forgive me, Master. I had unexpected uh, reunion with some friends. Seemed they had a mind to kill me. And just when I thought we'd be getting on so well. Your job is to give me answers, Karatu. No excuse. Uh, we can ill afford to let a few stray rats foil our plans. Should they return, kill them. This is your final warning. The next time you'll fail me, it will be your last. No way! Does he have to say it like that? Fine, fine, I'll... It will never be said that I'm not a loyal soldier. He's the master? Oh, he didn't kill the master. The master bloody... He backstabbed the other dude. Alright. Now we won't get level 45, but my god. We have a lot of things to do. Oh, my dog is complaining so badly. I'll have to go and check him out for a second. Oh, I'm just getting hungry. It's like 6. Yeah, it's 6 p.m. I had some time and I felt like, yeah, I should do something. Like, yesterday morning I was actually planning on streaming. But then a colleague of mine called in sick and they, well, yeah, you know, that means no streaming. Okay. Ah, once more the bloody crow has managed to foil our best laid plans. It is if his skill uh, begun with, uh, uh, begun with each encounter, but how could this be? Has he perfected some new training regimes since becoming uh, since coming to Eorzea? There's no time to dwell on past mistakes. Since the time of my ancestors, failure is one's duty. Failure in one's duty is unacceptable for a shinobi. My mission will end in success. Garasu's death or failure, my own. But all is not lost. Garasu is not the only one who has honed the skills. Fighting beside you back there, at, ti uh, at times it felt as we had trained together since childhood. We have shown rem you've shown remarkable focus and aptitude for our art, but you must grow stronger still if we are to have any hopes of triumph. Devote yourself to your training with the entirety of your body and mind. And Tsubane and I will do the same. I await your return, Une. Alright. So level 45 is the next one then. 
let's go return to Limsa and I'll let the dogs out for a second. Okay. Let us go. Let look. Was miss. Go to the Alf Castle. We have some stuff in the inventory I wanted to turn in. Seems also we can mend one of the gear pieces. A mend uh, materia stuff. Anything else? Okay, one of them is in. This ring. Yeah, 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 it's right, buddy. Yeah, I might just have to feed him in a second. Because he knows. He knows. The time. I don't know how. <laughs> also, what would we need to do for promotion? Oh, yeah, she has a mission. Oh, damn. Yeah, we might need to do that. Wait, what? Only three? No way. What was that mission again? Uh, let's check it out. Oh, grinding billions. Yeah, Aram Vale. Oh, ain't that nice? What level is Aram Vale? 47. Well, that is an opportunity. I can't refuse. Okay, yeah, do something else. Uh, let me go and get some dinner. I'll be here uh, in a few minutes.
I just I, I just couldn't watch him eat and like wait I needed something yeah Aaron Vale yeah okay well it's, it's not a problem I, I, I don't dislike the dungeon it's not that difficult but might have to take a look here cure free might be important but I think it's too expensive well I say that it might just be what we need cure free you can you, you can cast on like a target like so you and then you still have the range from over there I believe that's true that is definitely true so we're just going to hope that the party knows how to deal with things and that's the problem right trust I'll have to wait until uh, the other dog is done uh, eating. So they both can get out of there. How do you call it? Like a hole in? A, a pen? And then we can actually go. Now what is nice about this is that uh, we'll definitely... I think we'll have enough company seals. And also, after we've done this, we should be able to become a lieutenant. I think. Not sure, though. Um... Yeah. No. Actually, yes. We would become a second storm lieutenant. A commissioned officer. With the Maelstrom. Which would actually be quite nice. Uh, we have regen, which is great on the tank. Uh, cure 2, cure 1, medica. I wish we were like level 50. We got the medica 2, which just also applies the regen buff. Uh, the regen buff. Uh, so we do focus a bit on also we need to equip the next stuff by the way there we go oh my rings are absolutely horrible okay he's, he's eating um his kittle then the other one can go outside 
Uh, what I have to do is just close the door so they can both be. Sorry, that took some time, I know, I know, but we're ready now. Um, we'll just stay over here, do the dungeon, turn in the quest, become a lieutenant. Oh, fingers crossed. Yeah, we, just, we, we can actually use the seals. Oh, that's fast. Hi. Well, definitely not new. Wait, this is the ro This is Aramville, right? Does it start over here? Oh yeah, it is. When the arm is veil. I I why do people hate it so much? I don't really I hate this dungeon. So the tank hates this dungeon. Just stay to the left. Because it's level 49, it's level 47 actually. Stay to the left. I should have actually given him regen, I didn't. I should always give him regen. Okay, is that it? You you can eat. Oh, oh no! Great. Why do you stand there? <laughs> you know, shit happens. That's fine. Don't don't worry about it. Just, just okay. We go there. Another one. Oh, shite. Can we just get the fuck out of here, please? Ah, uh, You don't s just... I... Seriously, like... Just, just run. You, you run past these. You enter the boss room. Once you halfway in in the boss room, you go left. Come on, push, push, don't wait. Go, go, go. Come on, go. Just go, 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 go. Now, go, go, go now. Go here, go here, go here, go here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stay here, stay here. Don't do anything stupid. Now we do it. Easiest pie, just just go around the corner. Okay, stay to one of the fruits. Regen. That's one. Means that I need to start focusing on my healing. Just don't don't take it one just that. Go on. Try 
tree. Please take damn fruit. Oh, fuck. I fucked up. Oops. Come on, good. You have a heal. You have a res. Neo. Neo, res. Neo. Res or kill the dude. One or the other. <laughs> oh man, was not paying attention to that. I forgot it myself. Like, they should probably do two. Take take item at two, and then the next boss is like three. Go. Feel bad, man. Go. Let me just uh. This is the place I kind of died on my tank. Like, I didn't really get why. I just died. No, it's probably the yellow goo. I think it's toxic, right? Yeah, it's, it's toxic. I still, I don't, still don't like this dungeon. I got that already. Go away. Did I actually have that? Could have been the other one. Just, 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 just. We all know this is going to fail horribly, right? Yep. There he goes. Look at that. Look, look at that. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Absolutely. That's how you do it. love it. I should actually have used Presence of Mind. So yeah, I kind of did absolutely F up. How should they use provoke then, uh, Ida? I'm just curious to know, like, I'm, I'm not just here, uh, you know. Because I have a tank, and I most likely fail at the same problem. Dude. So if it's really like it just flat out refuses. No, it's definitely not an opener. Like with me, I usually go like Tomahawk and then just go AoE, AoE. Okay, this this guy, dude, seriously, could you stop taking damage? Actually, I think this is such a mean boss. Because this boss is definitely the weakest of the four. Five, actually, that you come across. He doesn't even move. Like... No, actually, he did. Never mind. I actually did I did have the, mon uh, the minion, yeah. Armville small. Greet the hell out of that. Um, yeah. Thanks. Appreciate that. Give him that. I don't know why, like... 
immediately they got off me, so... Starts on doing something here. I don't like these. Poisonous peasants. Where's the others? Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I, I definitely, definitely. It's, it's true. That range actually on Medica, of Medica is very, very well. Wow. Are we, is there a range indicator like in the game? Like did they add that? You've played uh, Ple uh, EVE Online right? Sadly no, that would have been so damn great. Wow, seriously? Get that, get that ass away from me. Yeah, that's that's great. I'm silenced. Dude, seriously, do something. Because I cannot do it. Alright, there we go. I hate this. This area I do hate. Okay, it, it is actually a very annoying dungeon. I didn't mind it as much on my... On my Marauder. Then again, I didn't have to keep me alive. Only that the button turns... Oh yeah, like that, so... No, it's still not red. But how much is that? Let's go. No fucking way. Give it a try. Why did the other guy walk in there? If this is going to be making me a captain, now fine, I'll do it. Fine, I'll do it. Give him some arrow. I know you should start with that, but I, I don't think this is the dungeon for it, right? Here we go. Final boss. Final nightmare. Ugh. We go. I might just go stand here. And I might just maybe. Everyone's too far apart. Alright, let's check this something out. Okay, let's do. Okay, she takes no heals. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, he's on two.
I'm on one. He takes the fruit. He's on three right now. Let's do this one. It's expensive, but I'll do it. Uh, that mage is going to get me killed. There we go, now it's just me. That is better. Going way better than the first time. Okay, tank is on free. Just go. Just go, do it. You can do it. Well, we learned uh, regen, loot, greet that, play a commendation, definitely the paladin. Let's go. Oh, my dogs need to go outside again. Isn't that nice? Wait. Absolute idiot. Guess what we'll be doing next. Yet I effed up so bad. You should read. So, so bad. Uh, level... We could take a new weapon, but... Ah. Let's go. Let's go through the gate. Uh, there's several in here, I think. At least there should be several in here. Oh, not Stone Vigil? Only this one, then. Never mind. I didn't read. I need to do it again. I should have spoken to Willemus. Blood for stone. It's over there. Okay. There is actually a dungeon then. Ah, man. I always do that. I always. I always just... Oh, I should read. I have to do it again. Oh, well. Is there anything in here... I'm not going to be using any of it because, well, what's the point? We're level 48. We'll be getting level better, better gear. No time. This is the one, right? Uh, want me to join? Sure. sure you're all is welcome. Uh, invite party. Uh, Helen online. Nadia joins. Call. Cool. Talk to Willem. From the maelstrom, I presume. Yes, I suppose you should suffice. The Holy See is not one to besiege assistance from foreign um, armies, but the task before us is a daunting one. And your own knights are occupied with, and our own knights are occupied with matters of great importance. Mayhap you have already heard rumors of Armville. Many a miner has been lured into the caverns recently by promises of vast fortunes, to find only death. And I, so, if the Noxgaden fumes don't get them, the carnivores found that lurk are happy to oblige. 
while there is little we can do about the former, dispatching the latter would go far in sparing the lives of unfortunate treasure seekers. So that's when we turn to you. Hey! Well, that nice. Here we go again. Aaron Vale. Well, haven't done that one today. But okay, it's fine. <clears throat> okay, uh, this tank actually starts right away. Red Fang Saint of um, of the fur. Oh, you actually start with the frog, huh? Interesting. Uh, rescue, never used it, never will. Basically. Hey. Either wait. No, he's like F it. Stay close to the wall. This time, I kind of want to do it without dying. That would be nice, right? So I'm actually going to be taking the fruit at two. Unless it keeps going like this, because they're actually doing quite, quite good damage. Okay, that healing too. It's actually quite decent. Let's make sure I don't die. Again. I'm out of MP. I die, I die, I die. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I did it again. Damn poison. Damn poison. Right, this time I will definitely be careful, more careful in this spot. Like, I'm, I'm not going to be doing the region raid until he does that again, right now. Go. They don't want treasure, that's fine, but I need the seals. Pass that. Pass that then. You need to go there. Pure as hell loves risks. I applaud it.
What the hell? I was out of that damn data note. Hey, level 49. I should have turned in the stuff. That's fine. I'll wait. That was actually quite smooth, I like that. Oh, he might die. I don't know. Paying attention to this a bit. He's just pulling entire floors. Love that. Please, please don't die. Taking the bloody treasure, man. I need, I need seals. Hey, they don't have to take it, but I'll take it gladly. Starting with the region is just so damn good. Also, the... Uh, the lucid dreaming of the... White mage is so much better than with the uh, with the black mage. I'll stand here again. Okay, that's one. Heal. It's two. Go cast. Yeah, limit break. Nice tree. Man, we didn't even have to take fruit. Holy crap, well done. GG, that was a great party, man.
That was great. Uh, let's get this roll, hopefully. I probably won't, but that's fine. Damn, cool. That was a good run. Thank you so much, uh, Ida, for joining me. Appreciate that. Always do. And you look awesome in the ninja gear. Definitely. Definitely awesome in the ninja gear. Alright, so we're here. We actually did finish this thing, right? Yes. Yeah, it's been fun. I love running the dungeon. So I want to queue up a event uh, for Sunday to Monday night. Uh, roughly around the same time as ever. If we have four people, if we, including me, we'll just run some dungeons. Uh, it's like playing an interesting song on the piano. Yeah. Cool. Got a lot of work with the FC uh, to do, especially with talking and stuff. A lot of people online, not, not a whole bunch of talking. That is a tiny bit of a shame, though. Well, you know, it is what it is. I had no doubts that you would triumph twice, Sergeant. But the swiftness and surely where, with which you have done so is impressive indeed. As head of the foreign levy, I dare say I've never been proud of an adventure under my command. Rest assured that your deeds have been conveyed to the powers that be. I look forward to the day when I can congratulate you on a well-deserved promotion. Till sea swallows all. Alright. Go. Promote me. You must have completed the a trial as well as rank 2. I did. See it already? If yeah, there we go. You're currently... Uh-huh. Do it already. Stop. Stop that. <laughs> there we go. We are now a lieutenant. By the name of the Admiral... I hereby appoint you the rank of second storm lieutenant. By this promotion, you are now eligible to transfer between the three grand companies of Eorzea. Here to entice more capable adventurers to join the grand companies. The alliance leaders recently introduced a system which allows the members of one organization to freely transfer to another. If you wish to sw uh, shift your alliance, you may do so by speaking to the personal officer of grand companies you wish to join. Uh, the procedure incurs a registration fee, though his payment is waived the first time. Uh, in addition to this privilege, you are also entitled to purchase land or an apartment in one of the residential districts established for adventural use. So here we go. We can actually buy a house for ourselves right now. If you have an interest in owning a state or a property, I suggest you consult the registration. Then blah, 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 blah. Monks feeling. Okay, yeah, we're great. Come on. Awesome. Shifting allegiance. Not too difficult. Uh, I might do so at some point. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, we'll see about that later. Like, okay. He has a blue quest. Which is uh, going to be the armory. Aha. Lieutenant, I'm certain that your duties with the Maelstrom demands much of your time already. But, if I might have a word. I'll get right to the point, Lieutenant. The High Ups have authorized plans to form a specialized squad. And we're on the lookout for a reliable leader. Your name was at the top of the list. You would be responsible for training and commanding a number of adventurers, sub subordinates, and the position also comes with the possibility of further promotion. What say, Lieutenant? Are you ready to lead? Of course we are. Man, outstanding. Let us get acquainted with your second in command right away. Oh, fuck. Can I switch him? It is an honor to be serving with you, Lieutenant Dozen, in my capacity as your aide. I'll be filling the role of Squadron Sergeant. 
all these eager troops. All uh, and these eager troops are a inaugural members of your squad forming up. Oh man, what do we got? Oh no, come on. Do we get a healer? I was always shy of bloody. Oh no, I'm a healer, right? So she is not a healer. She is like, she is like a black mage. So, oh well. One or uh, every one of them is a fledgling adventurer who enlists the hope of following into your legendary footsteps. They're green to the military eye, but will harden them up soon enough. When you have a moment to spare, stop by the barracks and we can discuss their training and development in greater detail. I'll leave it up to you then, Commander. Ah. What do you think? I'll admit, they're raw as soldiers go, but they'll, they're certainly have potential. I look forward to seeing what you can do with them. Right, I won't keep you any longer. Your squad barracks can be found through the door of the barracks to the command room. Uh, may the navigator never get guide you. Go. Cool. So, yeah, there we go in, and we can definitely order them around. And I like ordering, ordering them around. Enter the barracks. Also, there is an armory. Oh, they all look a bit different. Okay, I like that. There's a glamour dress and an, ar uh, an armoire. Armoire. Over there. Okay. Marauder. What are you? Conjurer. Never mind, see a healer. Great, we have one. What do you want? Uh, welcome to the squadron. Uh, hopefully you'll be briefed. New initiative. First and foremost, however, we need to increase the number of squadron members. We have three recruits as present, but our squadron won't be ready to deploy until we have at least four. Round each of an adventurous rule. Okay, okay. So uh, whenever we do uh, achievements and stuff, uh, we might be just getting a new recruit. And we eventually will. Um, I don't think there's anything in here for the enlistment papers. No recruits available. That's fine. At least we have it. And once we have four members, we can send them out. Yeah, okay. So he won't even... He refuses flat out to talk to me. Fine. Great. Have it your way, damn potato. Let's turn in the seals. As well as do this. Uh, we are very close to level 50, which I quite like. Let's turn in this stuff. How many do we have? Uh, seven. There you go, 8,000. Uh, what do you want? I'll wager a salty swab, such as yourself. Be keen to know uh, yourself. I I don't I don't speak pirate, okay. Be keen to know what went on at the big parlay. Upshot is the Elorian Alliance called for us. Units. What's that? Units? I mean, like, uh, a harpoon and a whale and whatever, dude. The unit B system that puts a bounty on them, but flound the law? I don't matter when. Oh my god, my dog's starting to bark. There we go again. Okay. So it's it's the, the, the und 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 be a system that puts a bounty on them, but flounder the law. It doesn't matter whatever they be man or beast. If you slay the troublemakers, you get a reward. And it is a nice bit of cooperation, of course. 
who still fight like squid and whales out in the inlands. If the Alliance thinks that people haven't noticed, a lot of them are drunk on seawater. But, that, but that's neither here nor there for you. Nay, it is the und we have you for. Put down uh, some mark, contribute to the peace. Common folk, thank you for it. Oh, so this is the, the hunting system then. Go to the build. Okay, F that. Go away. I'm not talking to you anymore. Go away. Now, we need to be level 50, I think. And... Oh. My, now my boy dogs are barking outside. This is this is turning to be great. Jesus Christ. I swear, man, I, I love my dogs, but sometimes they really, really don't like me to have my hobby. So, cat the sun for a hunt. Excellent, excellent. You appear suitable. Filthy, filthy-eyed and rough-knuckled. Bear with me as I cover the basics. So, basics is you get a hunt. I I'm, I'm not going to read all that. That's bullshit. You can get a hunt. And... These hunts, they have dailies and they will have like these monsters and you can just accept all, all of them. You go to the location, you kill them, you get a bunch of gill and you get some of these lion seals. And you have your weekly, which will give you a bit more money and more alliance seals. It's only one monster, they're usually level uh, 50, you'll need to find them. Uh, with that, you go to... Well, him... I think it's this fella. Let's take a look. No, it's definitely not him. Where the hell is that guy? Is it you? Actually, it is. I'm an idiot. Maelstrom seals. You can buy... Uh, it, it's like Glam. Can we just get my gear on, please? Look at that blade. And they're actually quite great, Luke. Look at that. Look at... Oh, wow. Yep. That is some interesting lambda. I love that. And you can buy these with a whole lot of seals. Also, if you have a house, you, with seals, you can get a dummy. And we did it the same way. You know, nothing wrong with a dummy. You can do these hunts. You get a tiny bit of money. You get some seals. And eventually, you can buy some stuff. Okay, so it's absolutely a nightmare to stream right now. 
with them going all weird and all. So uh, let's see. Is there anything we can do right now? We have a bunch of these missions. As you can see over here, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 of them. Which uh, will keep us busy for a while. Because that would be... How many do we have? They don't say, huh? Clear selection. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11... 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. There could be 31 dungeons, which I don't think is actually the case. Serious business. Where do we need to go? We just go around the world, I guess. Going nearest, working our way down. Let's go there. Uh, we'll start unlocking a few of them. The next time, we can actually start doing a few of them dungeons and trials. And I'm also considering just doing them with the FC. Just have some fun. Look at them. One of them extreme horses. They're always nice. Like all of the extreme trials have a chance of dropping a, a mount. And it's, it's, it's fun. Just collecting them. Why wouldn't it be? So this guy we already know. Uh, not a renishida are you? Ah, uh, no. Ain't no one says yes to that. You've had a familiar face, though. Come to think of it, you bear a striking resemblance to a brave lass I once met. Helped us chase one of them goddamned sirens from Ferriseris, he did. What you... Oh, what's that you say? Speak up, Miss Years or Hammerin. Have taken their tall years. And he wrote, you may not be half the heroine as their predecessor, but, you know the saying, any port in a storm. Aye, that's right. Damn if I can tell you why, but that hell brown hus is back. And she's running rock hearts over the place with a crew of her song snat flunkies. Me and the men I have... We have not to do but sit on our asses till someone cleans the place up. Look, this is more than a reclamation project to me and the lass. Discovery which killed her father, one of me prized students. I swore a vow to myself to do his name proud and restore the beacon. But these hands were made for hammering and scruffing with sirens. What say a fellow in, in your forebearer's footstep and fight this one for old Mimodia? I'll send word uh, to the guard in the lighthouse to tell you all you need to know. Okay, so we can actually go there. Um, I, I Usually I would fly over, but I think... Don't you teleport me over either? Ah, oh, you are lazy. I think that is the fastest way. Uh, we need to go to the Isles of Umbra. Yeah, go. 40 gil. Chop, chop. Definitely faster than flying by Chocobo. Not as fun, though. Not as fun. I'll give you that. Okay. Hey, adventurer. You've come not a moment too soon. The siren has hauled herself up in the... Lantern chamber at the top of the structure. The most direct route would be through the front door, but I fear the siren is already, is already wise to our intentions and has posted uh, the most formidable of her trolls to guard the entrance. Our only hope to breach the foe's defenses is to attack from below through the flood cellar. If you cannot win the battle for us, I know not who can. Go forth, friend. That Ferrocerius may shine bright and new. Okay, cool. New dungeon. Okay, next up. J. Corpse Gloom. Sure. There's a lot of it here going on in Mordonia. Actually, that's not true. We got the quest in Mordonia. We'll just walk the, work the way down. It's been already a very talkative episode. I'm sorry for that. Not a lot of MSQ stuff going on. 
for the last two hours we've done. We, we done what? Like three, three dungeons and a whole bunch of reading. And it was bad. I know. Okay, what's going on over here? Time for fun. Uh, is a matter of perspective, I guess. Welcome to Tala uh, Tala where heroes are made. I am Arl, and any friend of Hugobert is warmly regarded acquaintance of mine. Didn't mention he used to threat the stand, did he? Been trying to get that smooth-talking son of a hydra to take up the gladiator trade again, but gets easily distracted. Who does? Now. I'll wager he put... He, he didn't put two and two together when he heard your name. You're the last uh, Fafoyoni over there was talking about. Weren't you? Ah, I knew it. The liberator of Halatili herself. Thanks to you, we've made it nice and deadly here again. Go to restore the Colosseum game to what they were. It's no lap of luxury, I warn you. Place could use some more freshening up, but there are some lurking crawlies that need a good killing. But the brass blades are on the detail. So what do you say? Care to experience a new and improved training ground? We'll be holding uh, on it to have the Liberator of Halati uh, return as a challenger. And that should be the uh, Heart Dungeon. Heart is now acceptable. Alright, next stop. Corpse Gloon. Ulda is over. There, yeah, interesting. Okay, we just we, we just go back. We'll, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Over this way this time. Did I miss anything? Examine grave. There we go. Uh, so this is Leovin's grave. One of the people, I think, who died with the fights with the Galian Empire then. The tombstone has been knocked over and earth before it's disturbed. Yeah, corpse gone. So this is where Paul Leovin now lies. Well, is he dead? What's the meaning of this? Not only is a grave defiled, a body gone who could have done this. Oh no, could it have been Ida? The more I think about it, the more it makes... Well, I was going to say sense, but God. I will try to explain to the rest of us our little party of four was but a means to riches and glory. Such things as adventurers seek, but to Ida... It was her life. She blames herself for Everin's death. And to our shame we agreed with her. Though we knew full well we were all to blame. And then we left her. Where she stood. With her fiancé's hat. For company. Wait seriously she had it already? Ugh. But how we have been, but how, uh, how could we have been so heartless? Small wonder if the poor girl has been driven from her wits. But what's done is done. All we can do is admire, is admit to our mistakes and make amends as best as we can. Ever is gone and so is Lavin, but Ida refuses to accept it. She won't let go of the past. I know not what she means to do in Tamtara, but it can lead to no good end. I will attend this, this wedding, and 
try to restore her to her senses, it would be much reassured if you could accompany me, you know, as everyone did, so too does Edda look up to you. She may not listen to me, but she may just heed the words of someone she admires. And failing that... No. No, it doesn't bear thinking about. If we hurry, we might not... It, it might not come to that. Please meet me and Tamtara Deepcroft. Together, we'll put an end to whatever madness Ada is planning. Okay, fine. Black Shroud, there we go. <coughs> Anything else in here? Yeah, we have of course have this dungeon over here, but I think we need to talk to someone in New Gar uh, in Gradania first. There we go. A uh, Lollafellian Traumateur. Just so happen, uh, it just so happens a fellow like that went into Deepcroft not a minute ago. There was a young lady with him. Dressed head to toe in white. The lass was all smiling and giggling. Like a maiden on a wedding day. But your friend looks stiff as a board. Can't say I blame him though. Crypts do strange things to the best of us. You mean to head inside as well, don't you? Well, take care. Don't uh, and you take care. You don't wake the dead. <laughs> Alright, so this is now entering primal fear. Which is there. There's actually, there's two of them. Let's go. I think there's actually multiple missions that we can do there. But we'll see. Uh, where do we go? Over here, I see him. Into the archery guild we go. Uh, yes, I do. You have two quests for me or one? Those in, I have heard much of your deeds in the recent days. You've come to lend your strength to the primal investigation. Yes, your aid is most welcome. Who was the man in black? I shall proceed directly to the matter at hand. Though still unsubstantiated, um, all rumors stir amongst the town people of late. Rumors of a, sh a, a shadow-clad knight who rides in the, sh in the shroud. Under normal circumstances, I would pay such idle ghost stories little heed. This time, however, we have reason to suspect, but we have not to gain by rushing to judgment i would have you go to the streets you know speak with the people and heard their words with your own ears great all right that's great dude thank you for letting me do you do your job You. A ghost knight. I saw him. Clad from head to toe in armor that seemed forged from the shadows itself. Galloping through the shroud atop his hellborn steed. Mark my words, the three themselves were quivering in fear that night. I've not slept a wing since I returned. 
Ain't that nice? Why can't I not see them from in there? Oh, you're joking. One over there. One over there. Great. Let's go. There he is. Aiden. Yes, I saw the Black Knight. Uh... After which I promptly fret from my dear, uh, fled from my dear life. Uh, should you end up in my possession, you'd be wise to do the same. I have my pride, but I'm not foolish enough to cast my life away. Besides, one look was enough to know that a manifestation of pure evil, that uh, this is a manifestation of pure evil, where he to turn the that massive sword against Gridania all of our lances as one could not hope to stand in his way. Holy crap, you are a coward. It's your pride. Uh, making of a gun breaker, that's level 60, never mind. So, the Ripo, uh, Renonus, uh, Re... Rowena's uh, representative. You can buy the eye level stuff. Level 134. Some of it looks quite nice. Uh, let's take the X. Yeah, I think this one actually just grows a bit. I don't know. I honestly, I don't know. I'm not sure. Never had the Marauder gear. You. Don't sneak up on me like that, friend. Forgive me, ever since a uh, spying a glimpse of that ghastly horseman, my heart won't stop racing. I knew the elements would punish me, uh, punish us sooner or later for daring to disobey their will. This is surely a sign of sinister happening to come. Sinister happenings to come. People are so scared, huh? I saw him clear as day, or clear as night, you might say. With my own two eyes, more fearsome than the rider was his ghastly steed. I know not where you travelled, um, but I can, but I can assure you, you have not seen a more frightening beast. One thing I can tell you, friend, th there was no spectre or shadow, nay. He was solid as you or me, so he's not a ghost. Great. He is not a ghost. Back over there. Night glad in shadow forced armor. A mammoth of swords and a hellborn steed. It's clear now. Our worst forebores have proven most unfortunate presides. Can we just give me the thing? Dark divinity. A ghastly knight atop this baneful steed. It is as I feared. The rumors bear a most inauspicious resemblance to the references in an ancient scripture describing Odin, a dark divinity. It is my... wow, <clears throat> it's my voice that's caving out.
<coughs> okay, let's see if this goes. Wow, still not. <coughs> it is my suspicion that the Dark Horseman of Rumor is indeed Odin, and for furthermore, that this malevolent present is a primal and yet before the gods quivers take action i would seek the counsel of one versed in the holy writings make for query mill and seek out brother o ap o ap pepsi pepsi i would know uh, i would know what he knows and be swift dosin if odin is truly come to the shroud time is not on our side He is there. Okay. So he is a healer. You must be adventurer, I've been expecting. Yes, Odin, the Dark Divinity. Oh Lord Levin is under uh, understandably distressed at his arrival. As one who has read the scriptures, however, I am not entirely surprised. Odin, as the ancient writings have it, rode forth into our world, wielding a dark blade capable of cleaving earth and the heavens. By his fire blade did perish earth herself and countless multitudes of her people. At long last, a great the uh, at long last a great hero of Ella did arise to do battle with the dark god. Odin was slain, and his spirit sealed within a forest spring. For years, this was though to be where uh, mere wives' tales, a ghost story told by mothers to frighten their young ones into obedience. But recently, archaeological studies into elegant ruins have unearthed damning devices to the contrary. And now, these rumors, the scriptures claim that the dark divinity slumbers in earth's found deep at the heart of the shroud, where the power of a crystal confines him. I have ventured into the forest and seen the crystal with my own eyes, but this was many years ago. And uh, it is entirely within the realm of possibilities that something has gone terribly airy. And the feathers of crystal conf uh, confine the dark divinity no longer. I would send you to Urt's fort found to investigate the matter. But be forewarned, your path will not be easy. Should any evil spirit stand in your way, this water of cleansing should avail you. Yeah. Go. You know, it's actually quite fun that all of the dungeons have a bit of a side story. Get out at the top of the trees here. At least it's not you run to this dungeon. Uh, like you to you. You know, there is actually a story. Yeah, and see what there we go. We'll probably have a bit of a fight. Let's go to our white mage. Here we go. At least we'll get a bit of XP. Okay. Did not expect him to be this strong. Oh, wait. There you go. That probably makes more sense. Yeah. Regen. That goes a lot faster. We have four minutes to kill him. Should not be a problem now.
Oh wait, I've been doing arrow all the time. Okay, I seriously need to change that back. Because that is definitely not good. <laughs> what are you doing, man? Okay. Hey, we're almost up to a half a million, which is great. Like, if you're f leveling your first character, I believe at level four or thirty you'll get like a million, which is extremely nice. The crystalline goal that held the dark divinity in check. Were you able to ascertain what has become of it? Yep. Shunned it. Magical energy still remains in the stone, though its powers have grown dim. What's more, behold how the stone has been cleaved clear in twain by Odin's fell blade. There can be no doubt. Yes, there can be no doubt as the identity of our unwelcome guest. You And yet, it is almost most curious. It is almost curious. If the dark divinity rides free... Why does he uh, tarry in the shroud? Any road. You are to be commended for your bravery, adventurer. Simi is preparing a report on this very matter as we speak. I would be most grateful if you could share your findings with her as well. Hi. Right. Oh, Shimmy. Let's go to Shimmy. There's no shimming in here. What a bloody hell is shimmy. Oh shimmy. Oh she's over there. That's just great. So, the confrontation of the ultimate bane, we don't have to do. That's just entering. There might be a few others that we don't have to do. So, it is indeed as we feared. The seal of, uh, of Ult found has been broken. And the Dark Divinity writes again. I must draft a report immediately. Keep the money. All we want to know about Odin. Your assistance in the investigation has proven invaluable, adventurer. You have our thanks. With your aid, I've finally managed to complete my report. A thorough survey of all eyewitness reports, amongst with the most credible theories regarding the Dark Divinity's presence in the Shroud. I intend to deliver copies to the report of the report to the uh, brother Oapassi. And the bow lord Lewin himself. The science too will no doubt be eager to learn of our findings. I would be most appreciated if you could deliver the copy to Uranje in my stead. My duties demand that I remain composed. But in all truth, I fear for the faith of our people. Should the time come that the dark divinity dwells his blade against Gradana, promise me that we can count on you for aid. And not so many words, a few other ones. Okay, let's go to Orange. I don't think we can get to level 50 this way because the quests are very much like locked. I wonder if we can actually finish it. Um, because this is the final um, delivery I'll do. Um, what we'll do, I will queue up an event on Discord for all of the dungeons. Uh, but uh, what I'll do in before we get started with that is just I'll, I'll start doing all of these quests. Making sure I've done all of them. Checking out all of the regions if there are any. And then we'll do the event. Une... I am most hearted 
by the safe return where thou able to cast light on the shadows that haunt the shroud yeah there you go so it is true having awakened from night eternal slumber the dark divinity now rides free in the shroud while you were afield i immersed myself in the scriptures the more i scoured the words the more i did realize that the writings drawn heavy upon Elegant's history, uh, historical chronicles. History is quite a fascinating beast, is it not? One nation's glory is another's suffering. One nation's great hero, another's most abhorred villain. I mean not to speak in platitudes, only to say that there is never but a single side to any story. Even a story that is presented as historical fact. To that end, did the great hero of Alan Seal, Odin in a gaul of crystal? What impends the, to, uh, the dark divinity to write once again? Cast a light in, on the shadows of history? Friend, that we might be delivered from the darkness. Uh, critical hit, I guess. I don't know what else. And do you, do you get another quest? No. So what we'll do is I'll, I'll make a picture right over here because we've basically done his final quest. Uh, not final quest. Def by definition, not his final quest. Oh my God, he has so many. But this is where we uh, we will hold this for today. Uh, what I'll do then Sunday, queue up the event on Discord if you want to join them. Feel free to do so. Uh, I'm looking for three other people because I don't think there's going to be an eight man in here. We've got a whole bunch of them that we need to do. Yeah, which will be tough. I will try to get my assassin a bit higher by doing like the... Um, the leveling thing. But yeah, it's nice. We're going to have a few dungeons. Uh, luckily, this one, this one we do. Praetorium we did do. We don't have to do them again. So from there, down on the, on the words, we'll start doing them. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you hopefully next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.